concern yourself with that? Uh, no, I think uh, I think my role is pretty. I play a good role. You know, I'm kind of a leader in the room. Um, you know, I do what I need to do for the team, and whatever's best for the team, that's what I do, and, and that's what that's what I'm here for. Yeah. So you don't get frustrated that okay, I got JK ahead of me, I got Mike here, I got all these freshmen. Where do I fit? You know, you're, you're good with that. I mean, as a as a football player, of course you're gonna get a bit frustrated, but at the same time, also understanding what you do, what you're best at, and I, like I said, I think I'm a pretty good leader with those two guys, and uh, that's that's what I do. Do you feel like you've made a real push to get on the field, get more carries this year? Oh yeah, I think so. I think so for sure, and. Uh, you know, I, I just try to keep doing that every day. Every day I get a chance to, and that's what I'm going to do. Antonio, when you came here, you had a plan, and your plan was very Ezekiel Elliott-like. Mm -hmm. You wanted to follow in his footsteps. Now, obviously, that plan has not been the way that you hoped it would be when you first got here. Have you had to change your viewpoint of the way things should look for your career in the time since you've been here? Um, yeah, like uh, Coach, Coach Myers says a lot of things. It's never too late for anything. Um, and as, as I've experienced things here in my career, you know, some things have took a different path. Uh, but, you know, I, all the goals that I have for myself are still reachable. And I'm not putting any of those out of the window. And what are those, like, what is it that you, what's your new path in your head starting today? Be the best player on this team I could be. And, uh, you know, one of my goals still is to you know, play in the NFL. Um, but uh, as, for right now, I'm going to focus on what I can focus on here and, and be the best I can be. Almost every time that... Coach Myers asked about the running backs. He volunteers your name. It's his don't forget about Antonio. Uh, he was having a nice spring. He was a good player. Do you take some comfort in that? Is that something that, that you're really aware of? I actually didn't know that. Um, I don't. I try not to keep up with anything. Try not to look into it too much. Um, but uh, you know, that, that does. That feels good. Uh, it lets me know that what I'm doing is, is being noticed. Um, and I'm just gonna keep doing it, obviously, because it's working. What makes you a good leader? I think. Uh, my family background, possibly. Uh, I had two older siblings. They were pretty good at showing me the way. And, uh, you know, I, I had a younger sister, but she was always, you know, out of it a little bit. So I didn't have the chance to lead anybody. And coming here, I've got guys that I can help lead and uh, do that with. Antonio, with JT graduating, it seems like there's a sense of running backs are going to get the ball more. Is that kind of, as far as running the ball, is, is that kind of playing itself out so far in spring, you think? Uh, so, well, spring is more of a, you know, pass. That's what we do in the spring. We pass a lot. Um, so, you know, we, we kind of think that we're going to get the ball a lot. That's, the, that's the, the thoughts right now. But as of right now, we're just trying to get everything settled as a team. With the absence of guys like JT and Billy and all those, we got to figure things out, and we're doing that right now. Are you guys being more involved in the passing game, like as far as, you know, catching balls out of the backfield and things like that? Yeah, we are. We are. We all have to get better in that area, and we definitely have. What are your expectations for your junior year? You've talked about goals, like kind of big picture goals. What about just this, this season in particular? What are your goals, Antonio? Um, our goals? Are to win the, help win the opening game of the season so far. So. And what do you bring to the table? Like, uh, describe your game out there as a running back. You know, last year and my, my previous two years, I think I was more of a power guy, and a lot of people knew that. But uh, you know, I, I keep I've lost weight every year, and uh, right now I'm I'm moving pretty good. Um, so I'd say I'm definitely more balanced, a lot a lot more balanced this year, and I've got a, a lot more speed, get out of things. So. What are, you, what are you down to? You said you've lost weight. What did you what did you weigh, and what do you weigh now? Uh, when I came, when I got here, I was two twenty seven. And I'm 210 now, so that's a 17 pounds right there. You can feel it. You can definitely feel it. How? Why did you lose the weight? Obviously, that's what the coaches wanted. Um, Can't outrun nobody at 227. Do <laughs> <laughs> you feel better? Yeah, I mean, yeah, I feel a lot better. Um, feel more confident with myself. Um, confidence is a big part of the college game, and having that is, is very beneficial. How hard was it to lose those 17 pounds? Uh, I like honey buns, so yeah, honey buns. Honey buns. Who wants with the yeah. icing on it? Or? Oh my, the white ones. Yeah, yeah. If you're gonna go, go all the yeah, way. You gotta, you gotta go. give it up. <laughs> you gotta give it up. Uh.